Well, what a boost for Chelsea. Three days after limping off at Blackburn, Petr Cech starts for the home side. It's helped soften the blow with top scorer Didier Drogba and captain John Terry still on the sidelines. Only one change from the Ewood Park win and a change in formation too. Claudio Pizarro gets his first Premier League start since August. He joins Andrei Shevchenko up front. John Obi Mikel makes way. Without a win in four now, Aston Villa, but without the squad to shuffle things too much. The same side here from the one-all draw against Manchester City at the weekend. Stylian Petrov was ready to return, but he's sidelined with illness. Sean Maloney keeps his place. So Villa field the same starting eleven that inflicted defeat on Chelsea back in September. Scorers that day, that night as well. Chelsea, just four of their starting lineup start here, and it's Agbon Lahore looking to make mischief early on and rattles one just wide of Petr Cech's goal. Takes possession, comes on the inside of Cole and then hits it early into the new. Meaningful challenge in there by Nigel Rio Coca, and the captain Gareth Barry carries forward, sets it up on his left. Opportunity here, and Cech again is tested at his near post, although yet again it finds its way into the side netting. Well, Ashley Young believes that uh, Petr Cech got a touch to that. It was great play from Gareth Barry. Tries to beat Petr Cech at the near post and quite clearly he gets a touch to it. Probably wouldn't have gone in. Perhaps here's Michael Essien. Cech. If he was hoping for a nice quiet uh, reintroduction to uh, the Premier League fray, he hasn't got it. Now, first chance for Chelsea to get forward with their Peruvian Pizarro. Front side and Lampard will take it comes Alex Kalu in there as well so too Pizarro they've dealt with it and they have plenty of height back now the giant figure of Zat Knight among them busy work from Maloney to unsettle Paolo Ferreira and the corner kick is Aston Villa's reward we didn't deal with that particularly well just like this Zat Knight Rising highest, first check to the first test for Chelsea, helped on by Larson, and Petr Cech gets it away. Petr Cech in his last seven Premier League games. Gareth Barry's corner, Cech thought about coming. Scooping to head was Ricardo Cavallo, and the Portuguese defender's done well for Chelsea. And he's provided a platform for attack. And a touch there by Paulo Ferreira. Now John Carew, Larson has stayed forward, Maloney in, once away to Manchester United, once away to Arsenal, and once against this lot of course. Probably weaved through there by Joe Cole, who has started, as we expected, out on the right of that midfield, Trevor. Good Ricardo Carvalho's season to have uh, him make up the numbers of the back now, as Ashley Cole blocked off there. He felt he was, as I found the hall, matched him stride for stride, nothing given though. Six to one after than the other, wasn't it? And obviously, the uh, majority of the supporters here today are supporting Chelsea. They felt that part of his duty, of course, was to try and stop Cole from getting forward. Here's Maloney into John Carew. Goodness me, he was back in the nick of time, wasn't he, Michael? Ferreira. Maloney. And a shimmy to throw Pizarro off the scent. Sean Maloney has already got one. And he's got another! Another mistake from Petr Cech! And another goal for Sean Maloney! Never have expected Petr Cech to make that kind of mistake. That's the dummy, deceives Pizarro, comes on the inside of Alex. Alex needs to get tighter and closer to the player. Here's Paolo Ferreira, one back for Chelsea here, would uh, alter the picture dramatically. Hello. Ashley Cole. Salomon Kalou. That's an into the mix, that night there. Here's Michael Essien. A turn from Palak goes down under pressure, and Chelsea have the penalty. Well, undoubtedly, Chelsea get fortunate here. Essien really should have hit it first time. Alex to come on to his left foot. Doesn't get a good strike on it. But the ball somehow gets through to Michael Ballack, who gets go side. I think he invites the challenge. It comes in, I believe, from Zach Knight. 
there's Michael Ballard, there's the challenge from Zach Knight. Ballard goes over, inviting Phil Dow to give the penalty, which he has done. And the Chelsea crowd paying for a red card for Zach Knight. Denying at Guppian Cups. Scores for Chelsea. And they are right back in business. Just when they look down and out. Their records...